championship fight between Conor McGregor and Kimbo Slice. Well, for a long time, he's been mentioned with the baddest men on the planet. For a long time, though, the title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. All right, so here he is making his way to the Octagon for another heavyweight title defense. This has been the baddest man on the planet now for several years, and he has taken on all comers more often than not, leaving them twitching on the canvas. Knockout power for days. The question is tonight, with a challenge like this, can he walk out the way he came in as the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world? our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. So three years the gap in age between these two fighters, some differences in height and reach as well. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. <laughs> World. If he's the first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of five wins, two losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 225 pounds. Fighting out of Miami, Florida, presenting the challenger, Kimbo Slot. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 22 wins, six losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch now, do it now. Go back to your corner. The fighters touch him up. You ready? You ready? All right, here we go. Round one out. 
outstanding matchup of strikers. Any chance this thing gets the canvas? I don't believe so. I think when you have two high-level strikers like you have in these two men, they're going to go to the center of the octagon, and it's going to be a kickboxing match. A kickboxing match as you can see in a ring. Tonight we get to watch it inside of an octagon. Ooh, big shot lands. job to get the guard up there as the strike is blocked by McGregor. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Counter punch landed there by McGregor. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Oh! It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. How about that chin? Punches blocked. And he landed the right hand there. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. Effective punch there by McGregor. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. McGregor gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Kimbo Schleiss. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Nice body kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Schleiss gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can rally. Guy landed and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. And once he got to the top, he started to land brutal ground and pound until the fight was called off. Just a dominant performance from the top position. We send it inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at 
One minute, three seconds of round number two. Join the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Kimbo There is a new baddest man on the planet. There's the new UFC heavyweight champion. You don't get them all right, DC, but you thought this was going to be the result and we got a new champ? I mean, he has so much power and such an ability to shut the lights off that you almost saw it coming. Congratulations to the new baddest man on the planet.